Hey everybody. Well, it's an end of an era. <clears throat> We've come to the time where it was time to replace my son's bed. I had bunk beds for years. I had a futon on the bottom and a twin size on the top, and it is he has outgrown it. My youngest boy is 16 now, and he's taller than I am and falling off this bed, so we replaced it with a queen size bed. And I should have recorded a lot of that, switching it out, but honestly, I didn't have time. I was in too much of a hurry. Um, <clears throat> I might show you a picture of what it looks like afterwards, but we had to rearrange his closet. Um, we had to put his dresser in his closet to make room because the queen bed was so big. And <clears throat> the closet had one of those closet organizers in it, so we had to take the little pegs out of the wall and reorganize that and fill in the holes and then repaint the holes and make it look like it was supposed to be all along. And Anyway, um, my sister has got twin sons, and I mentioned getting rid of the bunk beds and she said "Ooh, I want it how much you want for it and of course the rule around here is if your family it don't cost you anything just whatever you want it it's yours so I'm on my way I got the, got the truck all loaded up and uh, strapped down pretty good um, and I'm on my way to take it over there to drop it off for her boys so anyway um, hope everybody's doing good thanks for watching and um, <clears throat> it's a little chilly out here today I mean, it's not Maine chili, it's South Carolina chili, so uh, it's like 46, which is why I have a toboggan on, because I'm cold. It's cold for this time of year for me. Anyway, we got the truck loaded up, and I'm thankful to have a truck that it, that it can haul all this stuff, and uh, yeah, hope everybody's doing good. Thanks for watching. So this is what I was talking about. We replaced that bed and got in a queen bed, and it's big. It takes up most of the room. So, anyway, just thought I'd show this. We had to repaint the walls too because that bed was against the wall and it was kind of dirty. Oily teenage boys touching the wall. Not to mention the bed itself, rubbing it. But, it's nice and pretty.